Hi guys, so I'm so excited to talk to you about this Reborn. Um, this is actually a really special Reborn. Um, this, this Reborn is, she's really valuable. Um, the wonderful thing I, I did not realize about her until after I got her is who the artist um, is. So I'll show you um, this particular artist and I'll tell you in just a minute um, some of her other dolls really quickly. You may recognize these dolls and they all from the very beginning have the same artist. I'm not going to show you my whole collection, just a few. These are Lee Middleton dolls. And um, this artist's name, and I don't, I can't remember uh, how to pronounce her last name, but Reba, um, that's the signature on the two dolls I showed you yesterday. One is hand sign. She is world renowned. And, um, who I showed you um, is the, art, the artist of this doll and this one, and they are Lee, Lee Middleton dolls. So let me try and show you the signature on camera. This, well, it's an impression on the back of her. So she is a um, Reva Schick. It's S-C-H-I-C-K. Um, famous artist. Um, so let me show you the impression on the back of her neck. So here you can see that this is a Reva kit. So I was really excited about about this um, after I purchased this doll. The artist um, who painted this for me is Janet Lawrence. Quite a few dolls by this artist, Janet Lawrence. Um, she did my daughter's very first doll, which I will show you all in a separate video. And that doll has lasted a really long time to paint. This one I bought in 2018, she did this. So, She's just really, really good, um, this artist, Janet Lawrence. She now lives in the UK. Um, she may still have some newer items on eBay, but she had stopped for a little while. I have several dolls um, by her. So you can see she's just really good. And I'm just excited that this kit is by the same artist as the Lee Middleton dolls. You can see she's jointed. And um, she's got full legs. You can see. So I think that, um, and she is just a little shiny, which is strange, but I, I barely even handled her. Um, she's basically just been, you know, dressed and um, set out to look pretty. So she's open mouth. You see that? That's really cool. But anyway. Um, I named her Marie Louise, um, so let me, um, get her dress and I'll show you her fully dressed. Okay, guys, so I'm going to put this on my Reba Reborn Marie Louise. I'm hoping it will fit. This is a three months, um, this is a vintage Carter and it's called Sweet Daisy. The line is Sweet Daisy. Um, some of them have tags on them. Uh, I find it useful if you're going to dress a dog just so that you can remember what the line is for the vintage outfit. Since these are collectible, um, it's good to remember. So, let me get her dressed and I'll show her to you. Hey guys, so here she is, my Reba kit, and she's dressed in the Sweet Daisy um, three months size little outfit. You can see the, the lighting here is better than where I had been filming the outfit. I've got her by the window, so you can kind of see what she looks like. So... I would say she's probably my favorite Reborn, and probably she's my most valuable Reborn. She's, I mean, I would guess she's probably worth seven or eight hundred dollars. Um, 
so you know she's pretty valuable beautiful uh reborn that i'm glad that i have okay see y'all later